Hello guys, episode 15. Starting off this one with the gauntlet. I've done a little bit of practicing on my main, but the 13 defense is definitely going to make it a little bit more interesting here, so I'm going to have to change my tactic a little bit. I've been doing a tier 1 prep on my main, but I'm going to do tier 2 on this one, I think. So, let's go. Right, let's... See how we do in the first one here. The the standard gauntlet is pretty easy in all honesty. Let me turn these sounds up a bit. There we go. That is the first ever gauntlet done on the account. Obviously much easier compared to the corrupted one. Let's see what we get from the chest anyway. Okie dokie, let's see how the next one goes. I scuffed my first prep, unfortunately, there. Only got into half HP. Damn it. Oh, I thought I clicked my food. Damn it. That was going to be a close run either way, that one, but... Damn it, it's a shame. The tier 1 prep is so much easier to do, but... The extra damage is actually quite noticeable. Hey, we've done it. The first corrupted gauntlet kill. Let's get them off. Nice. Tier 2 prep was nice there. I only had a tier 2 bow as well, but thankfully the tier 3 staff were just smacking him down. Not bad. Just got 81 mining. The game is so weird without any of the plugins, man. Okay, I've managed to get a really good tier 1 prep here. Let's see how it goes. Uh oh, that might have been a mistake. Remember, good. Gonna be a close one. Let's put that on. Come on now. Come on now. Come on now. Oh my god. Oh wow, 2 HP, not even close. I'll take that. Not bad. Decent amount of GP. 1 HP. Damn it, that was such a stupid run. Why did I make that mistake? It's so close every time. Oh, I just messed up at the end anyway, so it doesn't matter. For God's sake. Oh, I might be dead. Oh my God, I keep doing... Why do I mess up at the end? Oh, the standard gauntlet is so easy now. I'll take the combat achievement, so... My God. I wasn't even focusing, that was so easy. Holy shit, I'm throwing these runs so hard, man. Oh, why do I do that every time? Oh my god. There we go. Getting back into the swing of things a little bit now. Yeah, there we go. I've slowed... Uh, oh, 69 Dragon Arrows, nice. I've slowed down the pace a little bit, and in the last phase, I'm just stop focusing more on dodging and eating, as opposed to getting the hits in. Oh my goodness, not even close. 1 HP, wow. Okay, cool. I'll take it. I messed up towards the end there, as usual. That's the one common thing that's happening right now, is I just mess up towards the end. But I'll take it. 1 HP. Oh, 
putting it close every time at the moment. That's three kills in a row. Ooh, a crystal weapon seed. Not bad. Wish it was the other one, though. I think that's it. There we go. Nice. That was much better. I'm finding this is the best method of doing it. Just completely ignoring the fact that I need to attack him right now and just wait for the tornado to go and then get straight back on him. If I try to worry about too many things, it ends up just confusing me and I get tilted and die. There we go, that's another ki uh, kill count. Not bad. Getting back on the birdhouse runs. There we go, 10 corrupted gauntlet kill count. That was my second run of the day, so that wasn't too bad. And we get some dragon arrows. Nice. There we go. Almost fumbled that. What do we get? Not bad. Oh, damn it. I hit so many zeros at the end there. Another class one. Oh, bar staves, not bad. There we go, nice. That was my first run of the day. We're getting better. Normally it takes me a couple of fails first. Anything good? Not bad. I've thrown it, boys. I've thrown it. Oh, damn it. That was really stupid. Oh, there we go. That was clutch. I think I could have done that the previous kill, but I didn't put the redemption on in time. Dragon arrows, not bad. And there's another. I think I might be getting the hang of this now. Don't want to jinx it though. I got a random urge to come back to Winter Todd because I'm quite low on herb seeds now. I don't have enough for a whole run of like the same herb. And I also still don't have a dragon axe, so maybe I'll get lucky and get that as well. Alright, I can't stack up caskets this time because I don't have any bank space, so I'm just going to open them, like, probably every five. A few herb seeds already, that's good. I've got more boxes. Okay, more boxes. And some more boxes. Just spent a bunch of my money on runes. I've been getting loads of alcables from uh, Gauntlet. So every time I get to a certain amount, I'm just going to whack a load in runes. Because um, I do plan on doing a bit of bursting to try and just power level my mage. Nice little uh, combat achievement there. 
Oh my fucking god, no. No way. No fucking way. I don't even have enough shards to be anywhere near corrupting the... Oh my god. What the fuck? No, 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 no. I can't believe that's just happened. I've been completely fucking spooned. 16 KC. What the f- Oh shit! I don't even know what to say. I've never ever had this item. Oh my god, man. Okay, getting closer to the end of the video now. I own oh, a dragon haster. I did plan on getting 25 kill count at Corrupt Gauntlet and then ending the video, but I think an enhanced Crystal Weapon Seed kind of trumps getting 25 KC. I uh, didn't really get too much there from the Larvins, uh, Brimstone Keys. I've got an Elite Casket here. Which was terrible. I'm now going to go make the buffer, and then I think that'll be the end of the video. Okay, um, I could technically wait and try and boost for this to save 50 crystal shards, but because of the fact that I'd basically have to farm like 2,000 of them anyway, I'm just going to spend the extra 50 to have uh, this person make the bow for me. There we have it. It's not in its final form yet, but there is the bow of Feridin, however you pronounce it. Holy shit. This feels like such a huge milestone, man. Really wish this stuff would get out of the way so I could zoom in. In fact, actually, let's get some good gear on first. There we have it, guys. I don't know if I should keep the wizard boots on or the climbers. But either way, this is absolutely amazing. I bought this for when I, uh, the bow's corrupted. I can't recolor it yet. But, like, oh my god. First time ever in the game using this weapon. This feels like ultimate late game stuff right now. Getting to this stage. Looks so cool. Now we've got a new grind to do, which is getting 2,000 crystal shards. But that'll be, that'll be amazing. Can't wait to see what we get along the way as well. But yeah, thank you very much for watching, guys. Amazing ending to the video.